Hey folks, today is September the 16th. It's currently 6.08 in the afternoon. We're going to look at doing our Adjimat EA week number 77 live testing and review. If you guys recall, last week we earned 2.07%. The week before that we earned 1.53%. The week before that we earned 1.77%. And before that we earned 1.90%. So consistently earning over 1% per week, which is always a good thing. Let's go ahead and jump in and see exactly what happened this week. All right, so as we can see here, overall gain of 117.07%. And for the week, we are up 1.76% or $154.60. So definitely another great week here. We can come down and see. Obviously, we have trades open going into the weekend, which is a... Uh, typical for us here and just taking a quick peek here at the trades that we have taken and the pairs all right let's see what we did so far for the month of September and as we can see we are up 4.48 percent and we have two weeks to go in the month of September so we'll see if we can't beat that 7.84 percent of last month all right let's go ahead jump into the VPS but first we'll take a look at the news for the week Nothing on Monday. On Tuesday, we had core CPI out of the U.S. On Wednesday, was that core CPI? Yep, core CPI on Tuesday. We come down to Wednesday. Oh, okay, so that says core PPI. All right, and let's keep on going down here. We also had Australian unemployment rate and employment change, NZD GDP. On Thursday... We had uh, unemployment claims out of the U.S. and also retail sales out of the U.S. And on Friday, prelim UOM consumer sentiment. And one thing I wanted to check what our previous balance was. We can see last week we had $8,786 in the account. Let's go ahead and check out what we got now. All right, so this week we end the week up to $8,940 dollars so it's uh, a very real possibility that next week we'll be passing that nine thousand dollar goal that i had in mind so definitely happy to see that we were able to do that before the end of september we'll probably do it next week and still have uh, another week after that to go so definitely pleased with that with the results that we're getting with the Adjumat ea as i stated earlier we do have trades open going into the weekend we have two hundred and one dollars and nine cents in drawdown and the first day of the week was the 12th let's go ahead and see what happened this week okay so we got started right around here so it looks like we got started with a few single trades. These aren't uh, closed out in groups. These are all singles here. Nothing wrong with that. Lots of uh, small wins there. And then we have a small grouping of two trades. All right, so we're getting into some of the larger groups here. Here's a four trade group with the winner being $25.23 to keep us in a profit in that one. The next group is right here. And as you can see, we have $40.68, which kept us in the profit there. See if we have some larger wins. They're usually closer to the bottom here. All right, here is another group. One, two, three, four trades in this group. Looks like this $18.87 win kept us in profit there. And this looks, looks like a much larger grouping here. One, two, three, four, five, six trades in this group. And as you can see, $83.70 and $16.89 are the winners that kept us in profit in that group. So we continue to scroll down, we can see $17.25 and $1.95. Those two trades kept us in profit in this four trade group. Let's keep on scrolling down here. And it looks like the rest is a lot of uh, small wins for the most part. It looks like we have a four cent loss there. Small little two uh, trade group, $6.27 win and a four cent loss. So definitely closed out the week strongly. A lot of these small trades, they don't look like much, but they, they definitely add up and push us over the top. All right, let's head back over here. And 
let's see how you guys did. All right, let's check out Kelvin's live account. All right, so Kelvin earned 1.35% this week. And so far for the month of September, he is up 3.12%. Very nice. And let's check out Khalid's demo account. Khalid is up 1.91%. And for the month of September, he is up 5.38%. And lastly, we'll check out Alex's account. He trades the Euro USD pair. And you can see he is up 1.23% for this week. And overall for the month of September, 5.11%. So everybody is doing extremely well here. All right, let's get back over here. And let's go ahead and refresh the page here. All right. Hey, Larry, thanks for all your hard work. Will you be testing the trade copy service that Adjumet has that was mentioned a week or so ago? Actually, what I plan on doing is once we get this account up to the $10,000 mark, um, say we have a 8% week or a 9% week, that'll be $800 or $900. I'm going to start taking the profits every month from the uh, EA, and I'm going to start putting that initially, at least, into the... Uh, trade copy service that Adramat has. So I will be adding that. I'm not sure if I'm going to, I guess, report on that at the end of uh, these videos or if I'm going to give that its own weekly updates. I haven't decided on that yet, but yeah, we'll definitely be looking at that as well. And I did have some uh, some thoughts on some of the things I saw as I was going through their uh, their uh, trade history. So we'll, we'll go into that as we get closer to uh, me actually starting that test. All right, my demo account had a losing week of $203, which is so different than yours. The losses occurred in USD, Japanese yen pair. Let me see. I don't think... I'm pretty sure I've been staying away from the Japanese yen pairs because of what we saw with... I'm not sure what... Euro, Japanese yen. Yeah, I think this is it. I had a bad experience with the Euro, Japanese yen pair. And some people some time ago were warning me about Japanese yen pairs in general. And since then, I have not touched them. So, yeah, it might be a good idea to just uh, drop USD Japanese yen and not deal with Euro Japanese yen either. And just stick with uh, some of the other pairs that have proven themselves profitable for us. All right. I think that is everything I wanted to touch on. So if you guys have any questions whatsoever on the Adjumat EA, make sure you send them to me. And like I said, this is week number 77, I'm pretty sure it is. Let's go back here. Yep, 77. So we've been testing this for a great long while here. And it looks like, what is our average at this point? It should be about, I'm guessing, 1.2% or so per week. Let's take a quick peek at that. I'm going to guess just off the top of my head, our average is about 1.2%. I mean, per, let's see here, 1.2% per week times 4, 4.8. So we're a little bit below. 4.43% per month is our uh, average here. But overall, like I said, definitely pleased with the results. Even though that's our average, that's probably because we took some hits a few months. But overall, as you guys can see here, eight seven we did take some dips four 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 two five and then five six and then we had these months were that were losers but we did jump back pretty quick almost 10 percent in may 9.42 6.35 7.83 and so far 4.48 percent so we're definitely doing extremely well here and we'll see if we can get that average back up over the next few months here We'll see what happens. All right, guys. Hope you have a great weekend. If you want to test out the Adjumat EA for yourself, make sure you guys use the link below to help support the channel. And if you have any questions whatsoever, make sure you guys uh, ask them in the comment section, and I'll try to get those answered for you. Take care, folks.